Where's my control? Oh, I could break them. It's into please seal. Because I don't have to touch. I have risen. <laughs> seal. <laughs> I knew Seal would be the first to rise. I sense pleased. I sense a very pleased Seal. How does this game work? I can make my own pizzas. Oh, ew, no. Mm. It's a masterpiece. How does this work? Ah! This is weird! What the What, the what do I do? How does this how does Do I just yeet them into their mouths? Come on, get pizzaed. Ah! Everyone on pizzas? What the what? Hey, wait a minute. Ha 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 ha! Ahaha, dang it. I'm going down here. Nope. How does this work? Eat. Dang it. Give the pizzas. Oh, oh, oh. I'm down here. No, I'm not. You fat fucks. You're gonna have to go into fucking 600 pound life. After eating all this pizza, fuck me! What the? Da Is it? How do? All right. Uh. All these children are gonna have diabetes at some point. I've never seen someone eat so many pizzas. Chicken. I, I might summon chicken. You know what's worst? We're actually killing them by throwing them pizza. It's glitched. It's glitched.
Oh wait. I need to get I need to play it on my phone. So I can actually hear the uh the doodah. Yeah, the doodah. Yeah, do Alright, here we go. Alright, here we go. How does this work? What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Okay. Oh, my controller died. Begin tape. Leaving dead space. Three, two, one. Yep. I don't get how this works. I generally don't get how this works. Tape is to test automated response times and reactions from vintage interactive attractions. Yeah, I'm gonna get jump scared. Play the if you recorder. Are this tape, that means that not only have you been checking outside at the end of every shift as you were instructed, is it playing the recorder? But also that you have found something that meets the criteria of your special obligations under paragraph four. Follow these instructions, document response times, then safely secure the space before leaving. Upon sealing the room, you are not to return. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. But keep it running. Document results. I'm, am I gonna get jump scared? Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Not looking at the screen. Not looking at the screen. Not looking at the screen. Document not looking results. at the screen. Not look. Not looking at the screen. I'm gonna Begin look at the screen. I'm gonna look at the screen. Y'all can get jump scared. I'm not gonna get jump scared. Not looking at the screen, not looking at the screen, not looking at the screen, not gonna look at the screen, not gonna look at the screen. Oh, I'm not gonna get jump scared. Seal, you better not be lying to me. Look up. Okay. Then what? Results. Begin audio prompt in three. Then what do I do? Two. I've looked up, then what? Oh! It's, day. it's your time to shine. It's Fucking time comes. To I was literally shitting myself! You've saved money your whole life. Great. Now it's time to put all your eggs into one basket and take a huge gamble on your future. A gamble that comes with a 100% chance of success in some cases. What are we talking about? We're talking about becoming a Fazbear Entertainment franchisee. That's right, restaurant ownership and management. After day one is when almost the anyone can do with a limited happen. degree of success. Sure, it's a lot Maybe. of money to invest, but everyone's doing it. And that means it's safe and lucrative. With your initial investment, you'll receive everything you need to get started, including a small room, some tables, and electricity. But don't forget about the money you had left over after buying your franchise package. Use it to decorate, buy a stage, buy attractions and animatronics, and much, much more. Now, let's take a look at a few things that will help you get started as a fan. Let's see how much cash you had left over after purchasing your franchise package. Great, that should be more than enough. Now let's get started. On your left are your product catalogs. You can unlock more expensive catalogs by simply purchasing items for your pizzeria. Use the arrows in the bottom right of the item window to browse the products for each catalog. When you're finished shopping, click the button labeled Blueprint Mode to place your items. You can switch back and forth between catalog mode and blueprint mode as often as you like before opening your doors to the public. When you're ready to open your restaurant for business for the day, click the button labeled finished in blueprint mode. Give it a try and do some shopping.
I don't... What? No. Yeah, I don't have anything. Your restaurant is now officially open. Awesome. That doesn't mean your job is finished, however. You have a lot of work to do while patrons eat their pizza in the other room. From your terminal, you have supplies to buy, papers to print, and repairs to make. Once you've taken care of all the items on your to-do list, you can log off for the day and get out of there. Money for supplies and repairs comes out of petty cash, so don't worry about it coming out of your pocket. We've got you covered. The only money you have to worry about is if you choose to upgrade any of the equipment in your office. Now, onto other matters. Something to be aware of is that the ventilation system and your terminal are pretty loud and may prevent you from hearing things in adjoining air vents. That won't be a problem if there is nothing in the vents. However, if you feel that something might be in the vents, you have a few tools at your disposal to protect yourself. You can shut off your terminal and the ventilation system at any time to decrease the amount of attention you are drawing to yourself. Also, shining your light directly into a vent will most likely prevent anything from jumping out. You also have three tools available from the terminal itself. There is a motion detector, an audio decoy, and a secondary ventilation unit. Keep in mind, however, that you can only have one of these active at any given time. Now get to it. Simply log off when you've completed your tasks for the day, and you can I have no idea what the hell to do. I haven't played... I don't even know the concept of this game. I stopped playing since FNAF 4.
Why did I choose this game of all games? Yo, time out those bots. Block those bots. There's bl the, those two are bots in the chat. Block them. <laughs> Indian trade. Wait, what? I didn't know this was a part of the game. So, who's specifically on night one? No one's in the location. In fact, no, not night one. Who um? Who um? It looks like you're getting the hang of this. Now let's just focus on getting you through your first week. Who comes at night two? There's a big party here Saturday, and you should view that. Now the tape recordings. Test. Do they jump scare you, or is you that proven just a part of the game? The like the, the tape recording part. Is that not a jump scare? But the nights are. I, I am confusion. This game is like confusing. Congratulations on completing your first day. I was going to get security breach, but it's not all yet. this. There's thing another yet. aspect to your end of day routine, and that is inspecting and salvaging any animatronics found in the alley outside the back door. Things are found here quite often, and while we aren't they sure can't jump why, what oh! we know is that they can oh, be okay. for parts which can mean a much needed revenue boost before starting your next day. Of course, as with everything else in this line of work, do we have to do all these come with risk. The safest thing to do is to throw it back outside. But then you get no money for the salvage. Choose to keep it and you run the risk of certain negative consequences, namely death, should the item in question not be as docile as it first appeared. If you do decide to try to salvage it, then you must complete the maintenance checklist. During this testing phase, check on the animatronic frequently. If you feel that it is becoming unstable, use the taser provided to you. You can use it three times without damaging the hardware. Every... Use over three, however, will decrease the item's salvage value. Before you is an animatronic found in the back alley. We are unsure of its origin. I can. It is your job to complete the Y'all can get jump scared, I'm not. Or claiming it as salvage. Or, if you choose to, you can throw I've done the ticking thing. What do I do? I don't know what to do. Payment. Someone tell me what I do. Thank <laughs> you. 